In a remote village in Pakistan, full of refugees from neighboring Afghanistan, one woman has single-handedly introduced education for the girls there, Aguila Asifi. Herself a refugee who fled Afghanistan in the 1990s, has made it her life's work to teach refugee girls in the settlement. She's now being honored with the UN Refugee Committee's Nansen Refugee Award for her heroic work. When I first came to the camp, the biggest problem here was that people were not aware of the importance of education. Some boys were enrolled in school, but they were absent for weeks. School buildings were empty. For girls getting education and going to school was a religious taboo. Aguila's work in many ways goes against local customs. Them. Girls in rural areas of Afghanistan were normally forbidden from attending schools. Whenever I see a student of mine with a pen in their hand, when they solve a problem, when they read and write for me, these moments are my reward. I live with this happiness every day. My message is, let your children go to school. School is a nice place where they learn. Once they are educated, they get to know what is right or wrong. At a time when refugee numbers are as high as during the Second World War, every effort towards making their situations better must be honored. South South News, New York.